This is dictatorship. <laughs> Guruji, what is your ambition? <laughs> you, did you just come in? <laughs> <laughs> No, no ambition, I'm just fooling around, that's all. Uh, Guruji, I, I got a question for you. Uh, can you comment about your laughter? I've I'm seen sorry? a lot of people laugh, but nobody laughs like you. You have such a joyful laugh, it comes of from course, your, everybody from laughs within. differently, so what's the problem with that? <laughs> See, uh, these days, these kind of things are going on, some pathetic a pathetic kind of yoga is going on. People call this laughing yoga, <laughs> okay. Both of us stand in front of each other and say, you say he he he, I say he 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 <laughs> This is crazy. <laughs> See, this is like, you… you understand there must be flowers in the garden. If you want flowers in the garden, you don't buy plastic flowers and fix it there. You have to do something which doesn't look like flowers. You have to handle the soil, you have to handle the manure, water, sunlight. None of them look like flowers, none of them feel like flowers, none of them smell like flowers. But if you handle these things right, flowers will come. So laughter will come not because you have taken a stand, every day I must laugh for… You know, because just recently I was reading somewhere, somebody is advising one American uh, to do teachers, you know, what are the things you must do? Every day, ten minutes a day, you must laugh. <laughs> you will be in the psychiatry department soon <laughs> If you are in a certain state of pleasantness within you, without knowing why, a smile will spread on your face. With a very little tickle, you will laugh <laughs> So. Laughter is a consequence, don't try to create the consequence. You work the process, the source. This is the… okay, this ambition can be handled like this, uh, the young man is asking about ambition. See, ambition means you are resulted… you are interested in the result. Recently when we did this business event in India, so they all came to our yoga center, which is spread over four hundred acres and four, four thousand plus people are living there and lot of things happening, variety of activity. All are volunteers, nobody is paid for, nobody is trained for the job <laughs> and you can't fire anybody because they're volunteers <laughs> Look at my troubles <laughs> So they looked at this and said, these are all top companies in India and they said, how do you run this place with such efficiency? We take the best people from management schools, we cannot run it like this. What is… what is the secret of this management? I said, see, this is all. We are devotees, not devotees of some god. We are devotees of the process that we have taken on. We are devoted to the process, not to the result. Because we are so devoted to the simple process that we are doing, everything looks phenomenal and there are results. Result is a consequence. You are only interested in the flower, not in the root. You think you're going to have a flower? So, whether it is joy or success is a consequence. We are too focused on the consequence. You need to be devoted to the process. Thank you, Thank you guys very much. Thank you very much. Maybe again next year. <laughs>